so I'm looking it up again today, but I just wanted to make this video for you all. So today we're going to talk about the homeboy hoover. This is another tactic narcissists use as a means to control you when they're having trouble having access to you, when they're having trouble getting close to you again, or when they're having trouble controlling you. They will send somebody they know or somebody that is their friend to get close to you to see how much you know about what they've done behind your back. They'll pretty much play with your connections, pretty much playing with your circle of friends or your love life. They will have these people stay on top of you, get close to you, or even, you know, like dibble and dabble in the relationship that you have with this person behind your back without you even knowing. So they do this as a means to control who you're sleeping with. They'll pretty much coach people on how to manipulate you and take advantage of you just to kind of laugh about it behind your back. They want to control who you're dealing with so they can feel like they are in control. Do you get what I'm saying? Are you following so far? Or another way they do this in order to sabotage a connection that you have going on, they'll go up to another person and, you know, tell them all this junk about you in order to sabotage the relationship. So it's like what they have done to you in the past. Hey, mama. What they have done to you in the past in order for them to cover it up, they go to another person that you are dealing with to sabotage that connection so that you have the same outcome that you have with them. They want you to have the same outcome that you have with the new person so that it solidifies the story about who they have painted you out. You probably won't find out that they have something to do with what y'all got going on until later on. Take, for instance, the video that I made on false programming. You might want to watch that if you are interested in what I have to say as far as this video or if this has happened to you. They're pretty much going to coach and teach other people or that new person on how to manipulate you. This is another means on why you keep getting gaslit. First love bomb and then gaslit. And then it's like <clears throat> when things are not going right between you and that new person or that new connection, they're going to rely on that old person on how to deal with you. They got to keep running back to that person on how they secretly want you. They might even try to contact you while you're dealing with the new person. You know, like I was saying, they secretly want you or they're upset because they can no longer deal with you anymore. They're mad because you cut them off, so they have to ruin your future connections. They don't want you to be happy. They just want people to say, see, look, you know, he, she is this or he, she is that. Because it's like if two people or how many ever people are playing in the background of your new connection, it makes, you know, the story seem true about what they've been saying about you. So again, you might want to look back at my video when it comes down to false. So that's all for today, guys. And if anybody tell you that they love you today, I love you and I want you to keep going. Keep pushing on. Keep working on yourself. Don't ever stop.